Hey guys, what's going on? Ben here. So we have a fun video today. Uh, if you guys haven't seen, Panini launched the Monopoly on their website. This is a different Monopoly from what you see in Target, what is readily available. But yeah, so I made a video about this actually the last year. And it was a pain in the butt. You could not access the website, get on the website. And it was really annoying. Um, and I was really excited as a product that I like because my wife and I like board games. So it kind of incorporates that with cards. I know some people don't like it, but this is, this is a fun product for me and I enjoy it. I actually have played the game before. Uh, it is fun. I played it three or four times now, uh, last year's and I've been working on the set. So, um, cause you can use all of them in the set for the game. So anyway, aside from all that today, it just, you knew it was going to be bad because backing up um, on Friday, I believe, they had rewards. So for Panini Rewards, it was a big drop. A lot of different autos, a lot of really neat autos. And it, the site just crashed, blocked. Um, I added a Von Miller rookie auto to my cart. And it just, I got shut down. It like added to my cart. I went to check out and then was gone. Uh, so just a lot of issues on that part. And then you get to today. Uh, big drop with Monopoly, and let me show you guys. So I I know a lot of people probably already saw this already, um, just in general how it went. But here we are. So um, I tried to do this. So twelve twenty two is finally when I was first able to really get on the website uh, because from basically it was supposed to start at twelve on twelve o'clock from basically twelve twenty two the whole site was like crashed and they like took it off. No one could even access the website. So. Um, well, that's a that's a later photo, but these are even later. Sorry, so twelve twenty two. Yep. So that's the message I was getting. Then you go to twelve thirty seven, and it becomes a new message: network error, um, status code. That a lot of times means like it's on your end. I don't know, but a lot of people are getting the same message. I do not use any VPN or anything like that. So um, yeah, don't know the reason for that. Um, so now this was a. Um, Someone posted on Twitter, I did not get this as well, um, but a lot of people got this. So the Panini just kind of went under maintenance again. Um, here I am, it still says it's in card at 102, but I was still not able to get any. <laughs> um, I was still trying, still trying. Um, so there's the same picture. Get to 121, same thing. So now we're an hour and 20 minutes past when the drop window started. Um, 132, same thing. And then 155 was the first one. I was still trying uh, this whole time. 155 was really the first, um, yeah, really the first time that I saw it was out. And then, yeah, so 155 was officially, it was gone. And I was trying pretty consistently the whole time, didn't get a thing. So, you know, it's uh, it was frustrating um, because I wanted them for myself. I was probably, I was, Planning to buy two, not a lot. Um, you can see, I think most of these say two, maybe three, but two or two or three, um, not cases or anything like that, because I I want to break one and I was going to keep one sealed and that's all I was going to do. I have a sealed box collection. Um, I break things occasionally, but I have a whole cabinet of sealed boxes I like to keep sealed. Um, I do not want to. A lot of these. The problem with this is last years are going for eighty five bucks on the eighty ninety bucks on the secondary market still today, and those were thirty five thirty dollar drop on Panini. So people are expecting to make money on this because of the exclusive parallels and all that stuff. And you know, it's just a shame. Panini you would think after all these years the website would be better, and the website's awful. I mean, it's just awful, and they. For the amount of money they are making, I know they're at this point seem like they're on the downswing with everything, but man, it, it was frustrating because I just wanted them for myself. And I know a lot of people are going to buy it just to flip and things like that. So because that's something I want for my collection, uh, I'm probably at some point going to bite the bullet and buy one on the secondary market. Not going to be now. Like last year's, I got literally like a month ago. So I waited, what, 11 months. It's not in any hurry for me. Um, it's more just, I want it for my collection, my sealed box collection. So let me know in the comment section, guys, did you try to get the box as well? I think a lot of people were struggling, but I just want to hear what your experience has been with Panini's you know, website or even just in general. Um, that was my experience and 
yeah so i hope you guys enjoyed um i will do a, a full video of the man cave here at some point um i'm from a spot i don't usually record in so you can see the khabib connor uh, fight poster and the apollo creed rocky so i have a bunch of different stuff but i will give you guys that video soon so i hope you enjoyed like subscribe i'll see you guys on the next one